gravesite. They called us in one morning and they told us the baby was unresponsive. And placed flowers at the marker. They had just watched the casket lower into the ground. I just wanted to get it over. He'd been out long enough, so you know, you just want your child, you know, to rest and go on with the Lord. Baby boy Netfa Jabari Malcolm Jr. died March 2nd, just two weeks after he was born premature. But his family says their grief soon morphed into anger. What are they doing with that casket right there? That's the wrong casket. During the funeral, the family says officials from Elijah Bell Funeral Home stopped the service to switch caskets. And then I see them come and they took the casket back out of the hole and went into the um, car. And meanwhile, the other one pulled up and they brought the, the, our baby out and put him out there. Relatives caught workers on camera carrying a white casket that appears, if you look closely, to be covered with a pink blanket for a baby girl's funeral. They That's actually the had the service. They buried the little girl. They brought the little girl's body back out, brought my nephew in, switched caskets. He took the casket out, put it in the um, hearse. The other hearse came in with my nephew and they put him out there. As family members continue to snap pictures and take video of what was happening, they say Elijah Bell staffers made an insensitive request. They wasn't sure that the baby was ours, so they had to open the casket and verify the body. And then they asked us, do we want to do a service all over again when we already thought that we buried my nephew? Yeah,